do, I'm going to make a new Google Jamboard. And what you'll see on here is that I have the option to create, it says circle, but actually when you click on it, you can get a lot of different shapes. So I'm going to choose circle. And when I click, I hold, I draw, look, it's going to make more like an ellipse. If you'd rather have a perfect circle, the trick to that is I'm going to select circle and I just single click. So when I choose these tools, I click on square, single click, it makes a square. If I try to draw with the square, you can see I can make a rectangle out of it, which makes it a little trickier. So to get that circle, I'm going to go back to circle and I single click. So now let's try and do a series of concentric circles. So I'm going to single click my circle and then I'm going to single click another circle and I'm going to single click another circle. So now they're all perfect circles, but they're all the same size. Now notice over here it's defaulting back to select. So that allows me to drag and move this around. But then I can also resize it. So look at the corner right here. You want to get the resizing handles. So long as you're using the corner, you'll notice that it's resizing as a circle and doesn't stretch out to an oval or an ellipse. So here's my circle there. And then I'm going to place... This one, uh-oh, it goes over top of it. So I'm going to three dots, order. I'm going to send it to the back. Now, what is this one? This one, again, is right on top of it. So I am going to first resize it. I'm going to grab the corner, make it larger, and then I'm going to use the three dots, order, send it to the back. And I am going to move this so that it is centered. So now I've made concentric circles. They're all perfect circles, just of different sizes in Jamboard.